3D. Fad or fabulous? See if you can tell what I really think of 3D based solely on my facial expression. That being said, I do like the Fujifilm FinePix Real 3D W3 camera. It's actually kind of a cool little gadget. You'll notice on the front here there are two lenses. Two. And they're spaced about equally apart like the human eyes, which see in 3D. So is that a coincidence? I think not. The cool thing about this camera, other than the fact that it shoots photos in 3D and takes videos in 3D, is the fact that the screen, the LCD screen on the back, will allow you to view your 3D photos without special glasses. I mean, it takes a little adjustment sometimes, kind of like looking into one of those posters, but once you're locked on, it's like, whoa! And every time you take a 3D photo, it stores the 3D version and the 2D version, so you can switch back and forth. 3D, oh, that's a, oh, 2D, oh, 3D, that's what, oh, that's a, 2D's nice, oh, God, 3D, that's incredible. Another benefit to having two lenses, as this camera does, it has two 10 megapixel lenses, is when you're taking 2D shots, there's a special mode you can use that will take a, a far away picture with one of the lenses and let you zoom in with the other lens. You can also use this mode to shoot black and white in color, different speed shots speeds, that kind of stuff. As far as build quality is concerned, it's built solidly. It's it's heavier than most cameras. It's about a half a pound. It's a little bit thicker, but they've basically stuffed two cameras in there. Big LCD on the screen on the back. Uh, videos are recorded in 720p high definition and uh, 3D as well. Uh, all in all, not a bad camera for 500 bucks. Still kind of feels like the early stages of 3D. Like these things will be a lot slimmer and lighter and less expensive in a year's time. So after playing with it for a while, my facial expression in regards to 3D kind of went to like this. And it's not like, eh, it's like, hmm, hmm, hmm.